Okay, with diarrhea, what's important is that you really make sure that you have a lot of fluids with electrolytes. So you're sipping on water with lemon, maybe a bit of salt. You're having vegetable broths. And although these aren't particularly herbs, carob powder, which is a substitute for chocolate, if you add that to some applesauce, it's incredible what can happen. It just really works for diarrhea. And as long as you make sure that you're still having a lot of fluids, just mixing, say, two teaspoons of carob powder into even half a cup, uh, three quarters of a cup of applesauce. And, you know, a lot of people don't like carob powder because it's not chocolate, but really, when it's in the applesauce, it tastes great, it tastes fine, and no one seems to be too averse to that. And it works really well. Another thing is you could be drinking some carrot juice or making some fenugreek tea. And also what's really important is probiotics so that you get the good flora. When you have diarrhea, of course, you lose so much and you need to re reinstate that um, good bacteria. That we have a certain chemical balance in our bodies in terms of sodium and potassium. And so it's really important that you have those vegetable broths or you have a water with lemon and some salt so that you maintain those levels because otherwise you can get terrible headaches, you can get very dizzy, and those are, this is exactly what you want to be careful of. So home remedies are great, you just have to make sure that you know a little bit of going in the right direction.